Hi guys, uh, it's Angry Admin here. I am preparing article how to automate disk encryption in uh, vSphere. And I create the PowerShell script. And when I was testing on the one of the terminal servers, it worked fine. But when I move it to my destination machine, I got an error that one module is missing. It was strange uh, because that module is present However, uh, it cannot be used. So the only difference between those two machines was the PowerCLI Power CLI version. And now I show you how to check a PowerCLI version and how to update it. Let's go. Okay, so to check what version of PowerCLI we're using, um, we need to issue that command, which is a get module however we don't see any power cli uh, here that's because we need to load that module and we need to load by issuing the command so any power cli command so let's connect to vi server and we don't need to connect it uh, we just need to issue the command and now if we do the get module you see so this is the our version and this is version 11 we need to be on the 12.4 so there is one problem uh, with installing the module if you're upgrading the module because the certificate issuer change from very sign to digicert and there is no option to skip publisher check once you're upgrading it's only available once we're installing so i came up with something like this so <clears throat> the first of all we get module all modules from vmware yeah and now we are installing module and now i use a scope for all users and now I can do look skip publisher check that's what I want I want to force it and I don't want to confirm it so all right let's check it so now script will be running and what I will do, I will just uh, speed up a video a bit, so you don't need to wait with me. Yeah, it will take about two minutes or three minutes. In meantime, I will check if you like and subscribe to my channel, so please do so. Thank you very much. Okay, and now let's check if that worked. So, get module, and as you see, no power CLI, we have to load it again. So just let me do the connect the VI server. And okay. And now get module. Ta da! And we see new module has been installed. Okay, guys, um, that was a quick and I hope very informative uh, session for you. And again, I would appreciate if you like and subscribe, uh, share the content, um, follow me on the Twitter as well, and visit my Facebook page. Now, uh, tomorrow, all day after tomorrow, so today is the 8th or tomorrow night, I will post this article, how to automate your disk encryption i think that's very interesting um so watch that space watch uh, angry and see you in the next video bye